Hey everyone, it's Jeff and Randy, the research rat with peptidecritic.com. And today we wanted to do a short PSA on the importance of volume when administering your research compounds on your research rat. So we've seen this in our emails pretty consistently and on our community forum and on YouTube. Uh, in our comments, and it's, you know, oh, I'm doing three units, that's my dose, or the pen's accurate, uh, is there another number I should do to be more accurate? And there is a number, another number you should do to be more accurate. It's called reconstitute with more bacterostatic water, so you're doing closer to 20 units. The reason being, uh, you, first off, if you're using a syringe, this is an easy touch. If you can get these, these are what the kids, I believe, call the goats no cap, and then this is uh, the Amazon special. There is no brand. Uh, first off, I don't know how the heck you know what three units is on this thing, because, see, yeah, that would be two, four, six, yeah, so you'd have to be like halfway between there. It's just, it's not realistic. So you have these. On, on the easy touch, I can actually, I can actually see what three units is, but barely, and, and the reality is, you actually lose, you lose a unit to a half a unit, depending on which one of it, these it is, um, in the barrel that never comes out. So you need to use more backwater in your reconstitution when you're doing your math. On a pen, the argument is, well, the pens are accurate. And yes, some are, ours are. This is a, uh, this is a V2. And uh, if I set it to three units, and I shove it in this easy touch. There it is, three units. Cool. I don't trust that because if there were some back pressure in this, uh, you know, expansion contraction from it being in the fridge being out, it's not going to be accurate enough for three units, you might get three and a half, you might get two and a half. Whereas if you were doing 20, uh, you'd get, you know, 19.9 or 20 point, you know, one, which really doesn't matter at that point because you're within the range. And if you look at any of the tests on these research compounds, uh, when they're testing more than uh, three, more than one bottle, the fills are usually off by about two to 3%. So that's the kind of accuracy you're shooting for. And the best way to do that is with more volume. So if you're reconstituting your peptides, do not reconstitute it so you're doing three or five units. Um, if you want to argue in the comments, by all means, we love it. Give us the engagement. Uh, if you have any questions, please uh, you know, go to our uh, community at community.peptidecritic.com. It's an internet forum where we can answer any and all questions um, and make an account and uh, join the conversation. Uh, and as always, uh, happy researching from Jeff and Randy the Research Rat with peptidecritic.com.